morning, guys. Good morning, guys. Good morning. It is quarter to nine in the morning. Girls just got up at 8.30, but they're headed to the stable. They're both? I can bring the camera. No. I actually can. I can film the riding. No. They are both headed to the barn this morning. They're going to go and help do chores. We haven't seen our horses in two days, and it gets really hard and frustrating when we don't see them. One day. Yeah, we miss one day with them. Anyway, they're just going to go let them out, feed them, do a little bit of chores, come home, do schoolwork, and then we're going to head back to the barn to do riding lessons. Whose riding lesson is it today? Let's rephrase that. No school. <laughs> no, you have to it's do school. It's my lesson. Yeah, it's your lesson, right? Yeah. And she's going to really work on Storm. I don't know if you guys noticed that she's been having a little bit of trouble. A lot of you guys think that she was just jumping Storm, little teeny tiny jumps, and she was just walking up to the jump and trying to do it. That was not her choice. That was her, um, that's what she was told to do. She was, she's going back to basics and going slow with him. So that's, which, I don't want to. which she doesn't want to do, but that's what she's doing. And that's why it looked like that in the last couple of videos. But soon they'll be doing awesome together, I promise you. It's a process, guys. It's just a process of learning your horse. Gabby needs to learn him. He needs to learn her. He's like, what the heck is this kid doing to me? He doesn't understand what she's asking of him because he hasn't done what she's wanted him to do for, for years now. So it's all a process. And in a couple of months, he's going to be amazing. And she's going to be amazing. We just got to get there. And this girl... Oh, yeah. Yep, hurry up and make it. Today on the agenda for me while they're gone is I'm gonna race around the clock and get this house back to normal. I have been working the last couple of days trying to get stuff done, but we've been out of the house. It's been a catastrophe. So that's my goal. I'm gonna clean the house, get the laundry done, do some videos for Gabby's channel. I have two videos ready to come up on her channel. I just have to finish finish them up and um, that should happen sometime today or tonight probably. And um, then we're gonna go back to the barn where it's relaxing. Even though you're working, 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 walking five million miles, it's so relaxing to be there. Yeah, that's what today is all about. I always wondered, what do you do with all these balloons after the birthday? What do yeah, we do? I know, I what? Know, I know. Well, that's interesting, but that is not going to get them out of our house. I know. Watch how this. Is that's interesting, but that's not gonna get them. Oh. You actually pop them by doing this. Do it. Oh. Right, here's here she is. Get back, Ruby. You're not going. Bye. Bye, bye girls. I love you. Ah, Ruby. Uh oh. Okay, bye. We got a package in the mail the other day from a lady and her husband, and um, her name is Moon Mountain, and she lives in Los, Al Los Angeles, California. She sent to us this huge box of candy from Mexico, Mexican candy. Anyway, the girls at the barn had a blast trying all this candy. And it was so funny, so um, that video will be posted on Gabby's channel later today if you guys want to check it out. But yeah, thank you so much, Moon Mountain. Um, a few of you guys sent us stuff that really made our birthday, her birthday party, extra special. We had horse treats that we gave all of the horses um, after their riding, after their jump club lesson. Um, and they came from M. T horses. So I'm going to write that down right here. MT horses. That's her channel. Um, she also has an Etsy shop. Like you guys have already, like you guys already know, um, where she sells these things, but the horses loved it and made such an extra special little touch to Gabby's birthday party. So thank you guys so much for doing that for her. This is what happens to my clean laundry. We are here at the barn and the girls came before us again. It works so much better when the girls come with our instructor early and then we just show up in time for their lesson because they groom and catch the horses and then they're just, it's just faster. But it's 20 degrees outside today in Celsius, Celsius. 20 degrees is so warm. 
Yeah, it'll be probably minus five tonight, but it's so warm out. Oh, there's Gavin's store. We have 10 minutes to go. Hurry up. No, you do it. You should be already tacked up. Get tacking. I love your hat. You look so cute. The girl is hanging down. You have to. Oh, Storm's like, I'm not going in there. Storm, what are you smelling? Did you guys see him with the little kids yesterday with Brooklyn and Jacob? He was so funny. He's looking at them, then he's putting his head down, smelling their hair, staring in their eyes to see what the heck they were. He's like, oh, I want to go outside. Do you want to go for a trail right after? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Okay, I'm going to tell Sophie to wait too. Storm, you're going to be a good boy today. You're giving the Gabby such a hard time lately, you guys. He's just confused, doesn't know what he's doing, doesn't understand what she wants from him, huh? Yeah.
I'd rather you put your corner and keep your lead than lose your lead and get your corner. No, you're on your straight, Gabby, circling. Click, click, outside leg, outside leg, outside leg. Good girl. All right, ladies, take it to a walk. Let's change direction. Yes, Keep your outside leg on, not your inside. Do not use your inside leg at all. Just your outside one. Just your outside one. Just your outside one. Outside, 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 outside. Good. Now we're keeping our lead. Close your fingers, hands up off his neck. Support yourself with your legs. Outside, 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 outside. If you just keep your outside leg on, then he won't change his lead. I know it's hard. You're going to have to develop those muscles if you're going to want to keep riding that horse. He's getting pretty stellar lead changes. That was it, it's not that big. I can just walk over it. Nice. Good boy. Every time that my mind slip, I just see my past life Having dreams in a dream, I wonder Why I carried on with the things that made you lose your mind There's no way I can undo what I've done Can we be strangers against our fresh like a morning? What's so bad about that? So why won't you follow? Why won't you follow me home? Look up! I know click, I click. can't make you mind. Yes, I ran out of Grab time. There's no hope for me. I fell yeah. down the bottom. It'll make you two point two. You don't get to so do that. So I fell that. down way deep. Quick! Wee! 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 Quick! Like, but I do. Nice so you there you go. I let him walk. Watch to them, says to myself. Wanna hit the reverse on what's broken. Can we be strangers against our friends like a morning? But what's so bad about that? So why won't you follow? Why won't you follow me home? I know I can't make you mine. Yes, I ran out of town. There's no hope for me. I fell down the bottom. So I fell down way deep. But if I can't have the real you, then let me make a 3D print of you. my target it's a time to move on but I cannot I shoot in the dark 
So I miss my target Is it time to move on? You know so I can't So why won't you follow? Why won't you follow me home? I know I can't make you mine Yes, I ran out of time There's no hope for me I fell down the bottom And so I fell down way deep But if I can't have the real you Then let me make a 3D print did really bad really a lot better so do you guys remember when storm first started jumping he was going sideways to the jump and now he's going a lot more more straight so that's awesome anyway we're headed out for a trail ride to cool our horses down I think Gabby's starting to really trust him a little more the trouble is that she only has less than once a week so I think possibly that's gonna have to change to help them move in the right direction a little faster Taking this crew on the road. I feel like I want to climb up there on Storm and sit and ride bareback. It's comfy because he's getting chubbier. This car's go slow. It's more cars than ever. Yeah, supper time. More cars than ever. We got this. Who like me? Don't you wanna see what this could be? I am ready for that heartbreak That's usually how it goes I have done a billion mistakes before Maybe I am going crazy You say you feel the same Now that we dancing I'm taking my chances I'm going So you might have seen um, uh, Gabby had a little strap It was a stirrup leather around Storm's neck And all it was is a Oh my gosh strap Just so that um, Storm has no mane for her to hold on so while she's building confidence it's a strap for her to hold on to and the reason that um, it's better for him to hold this for her to hold the strap than to pull on his mouth so uh, that's what they're working on right now and when she stopped pulling on his mouth he got ex started to get excited about the jumps and a couple of times when she was going around the arena he went towards the jump like hey there's the jump let's jump it because um when she pulls on his mouth he's like i don't want to do it because it hurts him so with the strap she's able to hold on to that instead and things went a little bit better one thing about my kids that i love is that even though storm and gabby are in a learning process right now he's yeah, so smooth he's I so smooth him. can i uh, buy him from gabby sure you got five thousand dollars you can buy him from her Okay, I'm going to save up and buy him. Okay, but that's the whole thing. Gabby, no matter how hard the transition it's in, and, and the learning between them is going, she gets really exhausted with her legs. Like, I've never seen her be that tired before. She never says a bad thing about him. She never says, he's frustrating. This is too hard for me. She never says, oh, I don't want him. I don't like him. I want another horse. No, she doesn't even think any of those things. All she sees is love. All she does is see him and love him and she's just grateful for the time she gets to ride him. Even if it's a struggle, even if it's the best time she's ever had. But And I'm really proud of that because I can see how sometimes it might feel hard for her and somehow sometimes she might get frustrated just like he gets frustrated. He's like, whoa, I'm going in for supper. It's so early. 
Sabrina's already there. She's like, whoa, yum, supper. Yummy? Wait, wait. Wait. So, got Sophie, you came early this morning? Wait. And you did chores, and then you came back tonight, and you're putting your horse hey, away? Hey. That's what it's like. That's what it's like owning your own horse and having them live with you. So just tight. Are you up for it? Are you up for the challenge? Look, he always spills his grain. Like, come on. He likes to eat it off the floor. No. He just pushes it. Oh. Goodbye, love. You are a good boy today. I am going crazy. Say you feel the same. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.